welcome back to Rock Solid Motorsports. Today we're taking a look at the newest inventory in the Rock Solid inventory. Is this awesome 1999 Pontiac Trans Am 30th Anniversary Edition. And for 1999, Pontiac only made 1,600 of these 30th Anniversary Editions, making these a very rare collector item for that Pontiac enthusiast. And then of those, only 535 were convertibles. And then making this one just even that much more special is this one originally came equipped with a six-speed manual transmission. And of those 535 convertibles, only 175 had that six-speed. So this is the cream of the crop of the 1999 Pontiac Trans Am 30th Anniversary Edition. And as you can see, this car is gorgeous with that bright white paint, the blue anniversary racing stripes with the fire bird emblem in the hood scoop and it is a WS6 as these anniversary edition cars were and that bright white is complemented nicely by the excellent chrome blue wheels with 30th anniversary center caps and this is just an awesome car I'm really excited to show it to you now we'll go grab the other camera and do a test drive So yeah, now we're gonna take this awesome anniversary edition Trans Am for a test drive. Yeah, 350 just fires right off, like a low mile. LS should. Yeah. yeah. And it does have that awesome combination of the LS1 with the T56 six-speed transmission. And like we said earlier, it's a very rare option on these Trans Ams. And these anniversary editions are nicely optioned. They all came with the WS6 package. They did. Yeah. So WS6, Ram Air. Yeah, and that Ram Air hood, I loved the WS6 Ram Air hood on yeah. this generation Trans Am. It was super aggressive, kind of over the top, but it just looked right on these cars. It does, and it makes such a big difference on the appearance of these cars. It does. What a, I mean, it. It's a good looking car. It is, with that and, molded rear spoiler. Yeah. And that classic, you know, 69 Trans Am paint scheme, the, the bright white with the blue stripes. And those blue chrome wheels, I think, just really set these anniversary edition Trans Ams off. They do. They look good. Yeah, this is probably my favorite of the anniversary edition Trans Ams. I mean, it had the most powerful engine get it with the WS6 package which wasn't offered on the 94 model. I mean they're just yeah awesome cars with a handle grade, plenty of power. I mean this one with the six speed male transmission, I mean this car is one of 175 convertibles with the six speed so it's That's rare. It's gonna it be is. hard to find another one let alone low miles yeah. and this clean. Yeah, this car does is showing just under 20,000 miles. I think it's 19.9, just at 46. So probably 19.950 when we get back. But yeah, it is low miles. Yeah. And it drives like such. I mean, this is a nice car. It's been effortless. The six speed goes to the gears just like it should. The LS1 pulls with no hesitation. I mean, the steering is nice and tight. We got really cold AC, power top, AM FM CD, power mirrors, power mirrors, um, and everything works except for the driver's side seat will go up but not down. Uh, go front to back. It'll be front manual? to back. Okay. Well, yeah, it'll be front to back. Um, and then. We have not checked the rear defrost. No. Because so. we haven't been in that situation to frost the back windshield. Uh, but your steering wheel controls work. Uh, all space. your gauges work just as they should. Some space between me and this. Most Power of windows work. Power locks work. Let's see what this LS one's got. Yeah. Oh yeah. There was some G's 
noise there. <laughs> so yeah, it's got all the horsepower that's supposed to. I think they made about 320 from the factory, and it's it's all there. Felt good, sounded good. It does. Actually, the Corsa exhaust on this makes a beautiful V8 note. I mean, you heard it when I was pulling up at the beginning of the video, and yeah, it's yeah. a great sounding car. Yeah, this is it's gonna make somebody a really fun car. I mean, if you're looking just to enjoy an anniversary edition, one one that runs, drives, and looks right. Yeah. I mean, this is the car. I mean, or if you're just looking to collect, I mean, this is still a collector, it's a collector grade, grade car. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Awesome car. It is, yeah. If you're in the market for the just one of the rarest of the F body Trans Ams, you're definitely gonna want to take a very close look at this car. It's excellent, top to bottom. Yeah. So definitely stay tuned for that walk around. So now that we're done with the test drive, we're gonna go ahead and move on into the walk around inspection portion of the test drive video. And it's gonna be kind of more of like a highlight reel on this car. This car does not have many defects, and as we said earlier. But coming into the driver's side front fender, you see it's nice and straight, no dings, no stone chips down behind the tire. I mean, this car has been very well preserved. Come across again. No defects in the room. Might be some stone chips down there no. behind the back. Yeah. But <laughs> yeah, the blue chrome wheels are in excellent condition. No chrome loss, wrapped in newer Goodyear tires. Day code on those are 18, so I guess they're about five years old now. Come around the front bumper, might be, can't tell if that's a, it might be a little stone chip way low on the bumper. There, there is a little touch up right here on the one headlight cover. Yeah, another itty bitty guy there. Uh, the, the bumper for the age is in excellent condition. You come across the front of the car has that awesome WS6 hood with those aggressive Ram Air inlets. I mean, the hood is in excellent condition. I'm not really seeing any stone chips to know or defects at all. Stripes are in excellent condition. Come actually the passenger side headlight cover is in excellent condition too. Coming across to the passenger side front fender, again no defects. There might be a, apparently a little guy. Yes, getting picky. Yeah. yeah. But other than that, nothing really. I mean, you might have on the inside of the fender. Yeah. <laughs> but again, the passenger side front chrome, blue chrome wheels in excellent condition. Beautiful blue chrome wheels. They're an awesome feature on these cars. Good classic trim underneath the windshield is in excellent condition. The windshield itself is in excellent condition, no defects. Your rocker covers are in excellent condition. I mean, your passenger side door is nice and clean, no defects. Get out of here. I mean, your anniversary logos are in like new condition, shine brilliantly. The pressure side mirror is free of any defects. Pressure side glass, another bug. <laughs> but your pressure side glass is excellent. And the top, the blue cloth top, is an excellent. No pinch marks, no real signs of everywhere. Coming into the interior, so you have a nice clean door jams. I mean, the interior of this car has been just as lovingly preserved as the exterior. I mean, it presents like an 18,000 mile car should. No cracks in the door panel. Armrests in excellent condition. Carpets in excellent condition. Factory 30th anniversary floor mats. Your dash. Excellent condition. The passenger 
leather seats in excellent condition 30th anniversary logo and that blue stitching and it's you know throughout the seating it's such an awesome touch on these cars come into the back seat rear carpet it's in excellent condition passenger side the rear seat's in excellent condition. Your headliner is in excellent condition. Same as your sun visors. We're coming into your rear passenger quarter again. You don't have any stone chips around the opening. You might have some way inside. For a wheel that here is in excellent condition again. And the side of your rear bumpers in great condition. There is a little bit of cracking in this kind of area here down low. It looks like the bumper might have got bumped against something. Yeah, you gotta get pretty close to even notice it. And your rear spoiler is in excellent condition. I think there's any defects or like no warpage. None. Yeah. Stripes are excellent. Your rear glass is in excellent condition. The Trans Am logo is nice and bright with no wear. And that brilliant WS6 bag. And your taillights are nice and clear. You have Corsa exhaust. Yeah. Is that from the factory? I don't think so. Okay. Let's go one modification. <laughs> but it sounds awesome. <laughs> it does sound great. Yeah, the bottom of your trunk lids in excellent condition. Inside you have your boot bag with those Velcro. But then your trunk compartment's in excellent condition. It looks like it's been sparingly used. Carpet throughout is in excellent condition. And coming across the driver's side of the rear bumper as I smear some dirt. Yeah, that's all dirt. <laughs> Then your rear quarters nice and straight, no defects to know. Come down low, especially even inside the fender. But the front side's very clean. Might have again maybe some stone chipping inside the very innermost part of the fender. Your driver's side rear wheel and tire both in excellent condition. Coming to your door, might be a little nick just at the edge of the door but other than that your driver's side door is clean and straight with no defects and your emblems are nice and bright like they should be even around the door lock there's no scratching from the doors the keys and your driver's side mirrors in excellent condition your driver's side glass is excellent RPO tag still intact. And coming in the driver's side of the interior is just as excellent as the passenger side. All the lettering is nice and crisp. And this is one of those cars that wouldn't take long to make this car absent of dust. Your driver's side seat, the bolster is in excellent condition. The driver's side carpet, all your pedals are in excellent condition. It's a little bit of a stain on your floor mat and then we've got 
Something must have got glued to the dash at one point. It's got some remnant of some glue. But the rest of your dash is in excellent condition. Factory stereo, heater controls. Number 489. Steering wheel is in excellent condition. Same with your center console. And then in the back seat. Driver side rear back seat is in excellent condition. Very clean in a great LS1 engine. You just see how lovingly maintained this car is. All of your stickers are still nice and bright, showing a little wear. You have some excellent, well cared for engine going. Unmolested. See if we get Tyler to put the windows down and put the top down. These late model convertibles are nice and easy. Also, we have clips at the windshield and go back up. So the top functions just as it should. Everything's nice and clean. Operates just like it should, very easily. Yeah, if you're in the market for a collector grade 30th anniversary Trans Am that's just as rare as it is excellent, I mean, you're definitely going to want to take a very close look at this. You're, it's going to be hard for us to find another one this nice, this clean, and with a six speed transmission. Rock solid motorsports.